happens if you don't refrigerate your infusion, but drink it within 24 hours? I think it's that's what I often do. It's totally fine. The whole point of refrigerating your infusion is so that it won't rot on you. It won't ferment. Basically, there's so much protein, especially in some of the main, like the really green leafy herbs, the nettle, the comfrey, that the infusion will turn pretty quickly, especially if it's in a warm air, like the bacteria that are in the air and in the jar and on the wherever, they want to eat that protein. And so they can, it can turn relatively quick, but you will know when it turns because it smells bad, it tastes bad, it's just wrong, it's just off. So the nose knows, right? The nose knows. Trust your nose, and if it smells bad, then feed it to your plants. But I will often, so my routine might be if I make my infusion at night before I go to bed and then I strain it in the morning. So that's like eight to 10 hours that it's been out. And then I will put it in either a jar, a mason jar or in a thermos. I might put it with ice if it's the summertime um, or even if it's the wintertime. And then I will carry it with me throughout the day and I will just sip on it throughout the day without refrigerating it. Although I think that it definitely tastes better. Most infusions taste a lot better when they're cold. If you're going to an office job and you can kind of put it in a refrigerator in an office while you work, that's great. Pouring it over ice, that's great too. I'm a landscape gardener and a, I paint houses in the wintertime interior. So um, I just kind of have it with me throughout the day and I don't run into any problems, but trust the nose.